Hi there, it's Rob from Octopus. Welcome to Octopus Deploy 2019.1. This is our first release of 2019, and it's a big one. Our headline feature is Spaces. Spaces is a new feature that enables teams to focus on the projects, infrastructure, and deployments that matter to them. It's a new way to organize your Octopus server, making it easy to group resources together into a space for different teams or business areas. We've been working hard on this change for a long time and we're thrilled to share it. It's a simple concept, but it should help reduce the noise and make everyone's lives a little bit better. Now, let's get started. I have an Octopus Cloud instance running, and as you can see, it's quite simple. I have two projects and a handful of environments, and I've done a range of deployments. Now, I am currently in the finance space. This is a space I created just for my team. And using this example, I'm a member of the finance team. If you look at the top left corner of the navigation bar, you can see our new brand new space switcher. And looking at this, I have three spaces. We have a default space, which I'm using just as a catch all for common projects that could be used by other teams. And I have a finance space where I've got finance related projects that and their deployments. And then I have a third space called HR apps, which is any applications for the human resources team. So what is a space? A space is an isolated area within Octopus where I can focus on just my projects, just my infrastructure and all other resources. So if we take a look, you can see projects. It just has my projects infrastructure, and even coming to the library. It's just the resources that I care about. I believe the biggest benefit of this is simplicity and focus. I can concentrate on the deployments, the projects, my deployment processes, my infrastructure, only the resources that matter to me. However, there's another big benefit in safety. Spaces have hard walls, so this space cannot access any resources within the HR space. I can't deploy to any of their infrastructure, etc. So there is no sharing between spaces. And this was a key decision for simplicity and ease of use. This may seem restrictive, but we feel it's far simpler in the long run. So one thing I'm going to do, I'm just going to jump over to the HR space. So you can just see that it is a complete independent space. Uh, it's like a separate instance of Octopus. And now here, there's just a single application. There's different environments, my infrastructure, my library, etc. Everything is different. One thing I mentioned earlier is that users can be shared across spaces. They are global, but you can also have team specific users. The key feature that I'd like to mention is that you can now give team members or a team lead full administrative control over their space to manage who has access, etc. And this can remove a great administrative burden over system administrators, octopus administrators, etc. Now I'm currently logged in as an Octopus administrator, so I have access to all spaces. But if I now log out and log in as Rob, just as myself, and I just type in my password, log in. I'm now looking at the finance space again. But now when I go, I can only have access to the default and the finance spaces. So the two spaces that I have access to. And if I go into configuration, you can see, or see here as a space administrator, I have access to teams and users, etc. If I have a brand new team member start, I could add them to users and then add them to the finance team myself. And I don't have to submit requests or ask administrators, etc. And that's a really handy feature. This self-service security is sort of a byproduct of building spaces because we found we needed to simplify and revamp our permission system a bit. So that has been updated and this is a great new feature. Thanks for watching. Links for all the resources used in this video are in the description below, including a link to start a free trial of Octopus Deploy. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel as we're adding new videos weekly. Happy deployments.